I am a big enemy of generalizations. No, not all Casio quartz watches second hands miss their markers and yes, you can find Seiko bezels that are not misaligned. Taking your limited experience with one particular aspect of life and turning it into canon serves only to showcase your own ignorance. Well, except when talking about cats. All cats are assholes. The question, is there originality on AliExpress, is therefore valid and it's something I will try to address in this video. This is the Baltony Wilking Review. For those unfamiliar with AliExpress, we are talking about China's biggest marketplace. From 1 cent USB cables to $160,000 forklifts, you can buy pretty much anything you can think of. The watches sold on AliExpress have often been dubbed as nothing more than poor quality clones of famous super brands. However, as production facilities have been improved due in part to many watch brands manufacturing their watches in China, the stigma of poor quality has quickly died out. Originality, though, has remained a big problem due mainly to the abundance of customers content to wear a Submariner or a Speedmaster clone for $200 rather than spending that money on an original design. So I don't blame the Chinese brands for capitalizing on people's desire to look the part without breaking the bank. That being said, big companies like Seagull or San Martin are occasionally flexing their creative muscle and come up with original designs. A smaller company that has lately come up with both homages of lesser known watches of the past and completely original pieces is Baltony. The Wilking is a fine example of their excellent design and workmanship. The watch comes in the Goldilocks case dimensions of 40 by 47 mm. Its double dome sapphire crystal has anti-reflective undercoating and takes the overall thickness of the watch to a respectable 13 mm. The C-free field applied markers are placed in the vintage Submariner layout and are paired with a lovely pair of pencil hands of correct dimensions. Of the three colors available, I think the sunburst burgundy is really a no-brainer. Baltany were bright enough to keep it uncluttered with text, allowing it to truly shine. I just wish they had produced a dark green variant, as I believe that colorway would have best complemented the patina bronze. Speaking of bronze, the integration of the bezel in the cushion case is flawless. So are the steel ball bearings embedded in the fixed bronze bezel, making it look like a ship's porthole and adding to the vintage feel of the watch. The circular brushed sterile case back continues the theme of symmetric halves as it blends with the satin underside of the case in contrast with the polished side of the watch. And boy, is that polish flawless. The commendable attention to details is on display when adjusting the time too. Not only is the bronze crown chunky, precise and pleasant to operate, it's actually complemented by the Seiko's NH38 caliber, which means no ghost date position is going to ruin this timepiece's perfect balance. Just before the loom shot, it's my pleasure to invite you to subscribe to my channel in order not to miss the outstanding content I'm preparing for you. Thank you. Despite the 200 meters of water resistance, this is not a diver. That, however, did not stop Baltony from offering enough loom to last throughout the night and I am really impressed the seconds hand lollipop is still visible long after the markers have faded. Wrist, the watch wears true to size and its under 100 gram weight 
means it's as comfortable as any watch out there. I couldn't resist fitting in a matching burgundy strap from CNS, but the original brown leather strap is just as good. To summarize, this is an extremely balanced and well executed watch. If you can wait to buy one until one of the three big AliExpress sale events, you might get it for under $140, which for a watch with these specs and build quality is an outstanding bargain. And to answer my question, yes, you can find originality on AliExpress as long as you look for it. Thank you for your attention. Please let me help you find the watch you want. Goodbye.